Okay, so I, I watched the Amy Cuddy video about body language, and she was addressing the fact that she had discovered that with what she called power poses, the cortisol level was reduced and testosterone levels were raised within two minutes. So she recommended that we should take these under stressful situations, take the power poses for two minutes rather than talk to ourselves with um, affirmations or such. Mm -hmm. And the power poses were simply something like this, mm -hmm. or here with the arms. Seated like that? It could be seated or standing, mm -hmm. which I recognize as the, the classic 1950s sitcom boss position mm -hmm. that um, Darren Stevens is not allowed to have, but Larry Tate is allowed to have. Um, so the subject of, also, of social power is really important, and why she calls them power poses to me is really important. There's a sociological implication as to who's allowed to do them or not. But the biological Im implication to me, the genetic implication, is that these positions like this, like this, from a Del Sardian standpoint, are opening the vital zones of the limbs, opening for the surge of power. And the, or the primitive organism, not knowing social power, was just gathering energy, opening its strength for combat or flight or battle. So you'll actually see, um, I was always saying earlier, the um, Spider-Man is not here getting ready for battle. He's here getting ready for battle. And that opening of the armpit to increase the surge of testosterone and the pheromone zones being turned on. I also, and this one back here, which she doesn't mention, but is connected to this. Mm -hmm. You'll also see um, actors in um, martial arts movies when, and when they decide they have to go into battle, they're like, like, and they lengthen this up, and it's another pheromone spot that's turned on, so you combine all of them, and you have this here, here, and that back of the neck open, and you, you're manifesting a lot of power. What Amy Cuddy said was that within two minutes of doing this, if you hold a pose like that for two minutes, your cortisol level is reduced, and your testosterone level is raised. And what I've found is that even if I go to bed at night, and I do it now on a very regular basis, I lie in bed like this for a little while and take my legs apart mm -hmm. so like this. So I'm lying in the bed like this, and I immediately feel a marvelous sense of, ah, this bed feels good. What a nice evening it has been. Ah, and the stress of the day poof, is gone. And that's how I fall asleep shortly after that. And I'll, I'll refer the, to the Amy Cuddy video. It's on the TED Talks, so I'll link to that.